Oh, hey guys, welcome back to our channel. <laughs> so before we get to today's videos, so this video is being sponsored by the Call Me For app. If you guys do not know what the Call Me For app is, basically an app where you guys can get in contact with either YouTubers, photographers, sponsors, anything you guys would like. You just go ahead, sign up for it. It is free to download on any app store, Google, um, I'm sorry, on any app store, Google Play or the Apple store, whichever. Uh, once you register, you can go ahead and you can look up anybody and you can also find us as EMHL at CM4. Uh, like I said, you guys can get in contact with different sponsors. You guys can get in contact with even us if you guys would want to. Um, it's really easy to sign up, you know, just click on the app, apply, and then after you guys do that, um, just look us up. I'm sorry, I have my son cutting me off. <laughs> Enjoy the show. <laughs> Hey guys! Hey guys! Edgar has a haircut. Edgar got a haircut. Ethan's right there. We will be starting this vlog. And we are starting this vlog at this park. How beautiful is this park, Edgar? You have to repeat it twice. <laughs> well, I mean, I wasn't recording you the first time. No. <laughs> it's beautiful. I really yes. like it. We're gonna There's head off swans. back there. I'm talking! Oh, sorry. We're gonna head off over there. Where? To the forest. To the over forest. Nice. People are gonna call this dumb for saying forest. <laughs> Hi, crazy. Ew, you have dirty mouth. Are you gonna record me? Alright, let's see. Let's clean this up. Oh, yeah. Look at your cute face. Woo. Is that Oreo in your nose? Do you want to see your face? Then. Who oh, is that sexy beast? Uh, it's you. Hey guys, welcome back yeah. to the channel. Uh. He says, welcome. Anyways, so I had a little quick intro, just like, it's a little bumpy because we're like walking yeah. But we're walking up here and um, it was a little bit like shaky but now we have stationed our little picnic area Edgar's to my right right and I think he's here you guys is right also I don't know I don't know if this camera's like flipped or anything probably is hi guys <laughs> <laughs> he's here though and um, we're gonna be doing the what's in my bag well, I call it backpack, but even even though it's a diaper bag, cause I always wear it like a backpack. Like you can see, it's right here. And <clears throat> what should we do? Get started. Be like, let's get started, guys. So Ethan's gonna be here. He's a little bit. <laughs> um, he's a little bit emotional, sorry. but sorry, babe. cut that part. I'm sorry. It's okay. Alright, Ethan is a little bit emotional, so there's gonna be a few cuts, I believe, because I know he's not right away like out of his emotions. But let's get started with the video. So to start things off, this is my diaper bag. It's from Pippi Bear. I don't know how to pronounce it. I know it's P-I-P-I, -P -I, but I don't know if it's like Pippi or Pi Pi or something like that, you know? I'm pretty sure it's pig beaver, but um, they did nicely send this backpack our way. And honestly, at first, Edgar and I didn't think we'd like it because it's huge. Like, this is it right now, right? But if I feel like it, I can unfold it and it's even huger. Like, literally, it's half, it's almost half my body. But, whole point is. They wanted me to review it. I already reviewed it. It was so good, in my opinion, because literally, when I walk out the house, I don't need the extra space, but by the time I get home, <laughs> it's filled up on. This is the diaper bag I use. It has multiple compartments. I will link it down below. I got it on Amazon. They have their own website, but on Amazon, I believe I got an extra 5% off, of, I think. But let's start off by the front pouch of it. So, it has two big zippers. 
What? <laughs> Sorry. So it has two big zippers. This is the littlest of them both. And in this compartment right here, I have anything that has to do with his potty and diaper stuff. So for starters, this is a munchkin. Um, di what, what would you call it? Because Edgar's the one that diaper bags, right? Poopy bags. Baby so poopy. they're like baby poopy bags. Edgar bought these. I didn't want them, but like after a while, I started liking them because if I'm in a public place, I don't want him to like go to the restroom and then me throw it away and then it smells. But this is a lifesaver for me personally. So that's to put his poopy diapers personally. Pee diapers we don't put in here. I just feel like it's waste because pee doesn't smell. At least he thins. Next, I have diapers here. Usually I have three to four because he doesn't go to the restroom that often. Now, since he's eating more solids and less liquids, he we had four in here. Two are gone because he pooped earlier, like a lot. <laughs> um, that is pretty much it in this section. Usually we also have A and D. Um, what do you call it? Pumada ointment, whatever. Um, and I'm Mexican, so it's called pumada. But um, it's not here right now because whenever my mom takes care of him, she usually takes everything out. So half the things that would usually be here here are at her house currently. To go with the diapers and the diaper bags is the white bees, which is on this section right here. Right here, it's kind of like this side which is a bottle holder. Right here is a water for his formula, but we'll get there earlier. But on this side, there's this little slit to bring out the little cap for the white bees, which I really like, and which is why I have diapers here, because if I'm on the go, or if something happens while I'm at the mall or something, I just put this next to me. I don't have to be scavenging through my diaper bag. I just have everything here, here, quick, um, clean and it's done but on this side it has same thing without a slit and usually there's enough space to fit this water bottle for his formula and his formula bottle it's not here because he was drinking from it right now right okay. yeah and I guess he's still doing that but um, pretty much that's it around this area let me go through the back there's this little compartment which I believe, I don't know if I'm wrong, but it's for like an ice pack. Because you know how your back can get sweaty? It has um, a cooling material. Let's have it here. Okay. Also, on the back, there's this section where you could just open here and access the backpack inside right here. Which I think is a cool um, concept, but I personally don't use it which I should start using because if, if I'm in a rush, this is usually floppy and I'm like trying to find these zippers and be like, where is it? But I guess from now on, I need to start using this side. But you can see, it's, it's semi-empty in there. Now going towards the inside. All right, so inside right off the bat, there's a little string which goes like this and it connects just directly there has a little clip at the end. I'm not sure if you can see it right there. So usually I have his formula in here. This has three compartments, and in these three compartments, usually it has three scoops of formula each, which means it's okay for six ounces of water. And it really helps when we're on the go, especially in the car, if Ethan's crying, or if he starts crying at the store. We usually already have six ounces in the bottle after we rinse it out. And then we just open it, if it's not twisted, twist it, and then apply it. Um, I'm sorry, I'm not like saying exactly what products I'm using, but I, everything should be in the description down below. But I love this, love this so much, especially because Ethan isn't drinking so much lately. So like today, we've been out since what? 11. 10, 11? No, 10, yeah. Yeah, since 10, it's already 3.15, and he's only used one of these compartments. And, yeah, love that. 
then inside, I'm not sure if you can see, there's two little baggies right here, two sections. And one of them, oh, here it is. <laughs> it's not the A and D brand, but it's Destin. And we needed it earlier. Make sure this is here. I'm pretty sure my mom moved it out of place. But then I have this little sack of toys for him. So this sack, um, it is branded Mommy Baby, or Nami Baby. It came with a little wooden rattle that we got on Amazon, but that's at home. And in here we have just rattles, a little wood ring, which is quiet for the video and he can hold. And we also have a chewer, something for him to chew on, which he's most likely gonna like. But I'm gonna put this away because I'm not trying to know you guys for the rest of the video, right? And there's something here. Oh, sunscreen. We have a little sunscreen. Um, sorry, it's focused on my face. Um, it's SPF 50 plus. It's funny because we've never used this. And whenever we're out, oh my god, it smells good. Whenever we're out, look, smell it. Oh wow. Yeah. All right. I always have an um, outfit for Ethan. I always prefer onesies because I'm not trying to like when I do go through my um, I'm not trying to go through my diaper bag and pull out a shirt, socks, um, pants, a sweater, and this and that. So this is this has a hoodie. It's Puma. It's a little onesie. It's cute or whatever. And it's been here for about three, <laughs> two months. He hasn't had any accidents, thank God. But just in case, I feel like we need to switch this out with something else because this is cute and he hasn't used it because it's in here all the time. Honestly, the only things that are left in here are two side bottle holders. So this and this, but on the inside, I would show you. Uh, you know what? I'll insert a clip at the end. But as you can see, it has also that little film that keeps the things either hot or cold, which is where I usually put his, no, only one of them has that. But it's usually where I put his little thermal bottle with his warm water, because I'm not trying to have him drink freezing water, especially around this time of the year. But honestly, I can say that that is the end. Usually we have more things. Sometimes we have less things depending where we're going. Sometimes I don't even bring my diaper bag around. I just put like a diaper or two in my purse and like wipes and a bottle on me if it's just gonna be like a 30 minute or an hour errand run. But that is it for this backpack, honestly. And so that is it for this video. I wanna thank Hippie Bear for sending me this bag. I am obsessed. My mom is actually obsessed with it too. But that is it for this video. Thank you guys for sticking around and watching my video. I know it's not much, but honestly, Ethan is such a good baby. He doesn't get dirty that often. But if you guys haven't already, make sure you're subscribed. So the subscribe button somewhere here or here. I don't know. I'm pointing at those both sides because I'm not trying to look dumb. But uh, make sure you comment some of your essentials in your diaper bags if you have any. Or like... Recommend us something. Recommend us to be carrying something. <laughs> That's pretty much it. You know what? I'm going to button Also his on first birthday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to button on something. This is the first video where Chelsea yeah, doesn't get yeah, cut yeah, off by the camera. <laughs> Oh, I know. It's because we're cool. You know, we're in the outdoors. It's not overheating. But um, I will be uploading this most likely tomorrow. Even though it was supposed to be uploaded today on a Wednesday. It's going to be uploaded on a Thursday. I'm going to edit it tonight. Post it tomorrow. Hopefully, we can get back on the schedule on Friday. But if not, it's okay. Um, yeah, I will cut this video off already because I'm over explaining everything and I love talking and I need to stop but again thank you for watching make sure you watch other videos you know and yeah bye guys
I'm supposed to be getting paid ten dollars. Shut up. <laughs>